Hey, welcome back. I was just having a, a quick uh, read of this information post, and I don't usually bring these ones up, but when it's that interesting, it's got to be done. And it says, beneath uh, the, this water lies Derwent's village, once a busy hub of the uh, valley and an essential river crossing from Sheffield to Manchester. In the 1940s, the valley filled with water, and the ten households of the villagers said goodbye to their homes. Uh, and moved to the newly built Yorkshire Bridge two miles away. The remains of uh, the village remains uh, us, reminds us of the sacrifice uh, the residents had to make pro to provide for water for the East Midlands and Sheffield. Uh, in very dry years, the ruins of Derwent Village emerge from beneath the water and the late, uh, Lady Bower Reservoir. Right. Now I said that, I was looking over here, and I just thought it was like camping spots or something like that. But. That's the remains. That's all that remains from the 1940s. All of that. How crazy is that? How crazy is that? The amount of space that we had to build homes and now we're trying to find space to build the homes. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Oh well. Uh, I'll tell you what. I want, well, I'll try, I don't know how many videos I'm going to do today. Um, I'm not too sure on the weather. It's uh, looking a bit hit and miss. Um, but what I do is when I get back to the car and a bit later on is I bought a, a tour book first one I've ever bought uh, I'm not usually ones for that I usually ask locals but it's a bit quiet today and I'm going off the beaten track so I thought I'd better buy one so what I do is later on is I'll read through this and you can uh, join in through uh, listening to it and uh, see through the photos of the places I've actually been yeah sound like a good idea fair play right take it easy keep adventuring and love you bye